everybody, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Hardcore. Um, I've got up a lot of the mob farm. I just need more stone bricks. Maybe, I don't know, around, I don't know how much actually. But I just need to do, um, some lighting up and then just the roof and then a couple more platforms that they fall down of. And then I'm, but I'm also going to be making a stone farm in today's episode. That's going to be very, very, very good. So, pretty excited about that too. Um, it's a very simple stone farm. It's going to be using an ethyl clock I built in Operation Bedrock last season. Um, I'm building that one again. But, um, I'll show you what, also, yeah, I've torn out a lot to try and get stone for stone bricks. So I've just been making room and stuff everywhere. But yeah, I, I still need more. But yeah, I just need to do some lighting up around this places to, um, ensure that, you know, um, how'd that get there? Oh yeah, that's how I get up and down. But yeah, this is it! <laughs> and then there's gonna be, uh, let's, I'll, I'll come back here and show you. So you can see better. Like, those things again. And a huge roof above it. I suppose I could just use my elytra. Oops. Alright, let's go and up and I shall show you. If I could fly. Thank you. Goodness, but. This is it. I just need to make a roof above it and then finish those things that you see. And that's the farm complete. So, yeah, I'm just going to make a stone farm as well. It could be cobble as well if you watched Operation Bedrock, which probably not because I only get like five, four views on it each video. So probably not, probably not to be honest. Um, Creeper blew up right there. Happy was in my base. Um... But yeah, so, um, I'm just gonna get everything that I'm going to be needing for this, um, farm, and I'll be back. Alright, so I'm gonna dig me out an area where I'm gonna want this. This is where the farmers are gonna be. This is when I was trying to get some more stone as well. Um, let's move this stuff back, but I'm gonna need an area for my stone farm um so i might do it on the second layer or i can do it in here and then have some stone masons in here that would be pretty cool yeah i feel like that would be pretty cool to be honest so maybe i can make one like right here right in the middle but will this be enough space yes it will this will be perfect amount of space. But, um, I'm gonna get to digging this out. And I'll be back. All I know is that I'm gonna need a seven wide space, which might take a while to dig out, but it'll all be worth it in the future. So, see you in a bit. Well, now that we got the room dug out, um, which took a decent amount of time, not gonna lie. We got. Oh, how much sacks is that? That might, that might be enough to finish the whole entire farm. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> um. Yeah, this is the farm. Yeah. Uh, but now, time to actually watch the tutorial. The tutorial part of the farm. I didn't get. I didn't get the farm done. I this is all i've done which is do this you know what this is how much i hate this is how much i hate stupid junk <gasps> i just realized how dumb a move that is there's fire right there's wood 
right there. What the heck was I doing? But yeah, this looks like this looks very cool actually, and it's gonna look so much cooler with the farm in. But I still need to build that. Um, uh, I I meant to unpause the video that I'm watching, not the recording. I keep doing the same thing, dang it. And I didn't pause it, ah. Oh. Um, yeah, this farm is going pretty good so far. Um, so I'm almost complete with it, which I'm happy about. Okay, now I just need to finish up my ethel clock here. And this whole thing needs to be shifted one more block down here. Ugh. Great. Oh yeah, I need to place this lava somewhere else. Great. That's just fantastic too. Get it there. And then... Okay, um, I guess I can just build up this ether club now. Okay, now I just need to place in the redstone block. And at... Should have gone? But it didn't. Oh no, um... This isn't good. Um, great, well, I messed up an ethyl clock. Silly me. Huh. I'm an idiot. Forgot to place the freaking red, I mean, not redstone dust, um, blocks inside. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Most simple part, I fail. But let's get five blocks. One, two, three. Four, five. Uh, um, okay. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I'm an idiot. I didn't put the comparator the right way. I didn't put the freaking comparator the right way. How did I fail that? It's placing down a comparator. I did it again! <sighs> Thank you. And great, I didn't even link it up with the stupid pistons. Oh my goodness, this is... Alright, when I connect these lines up to these lines, that, that means the farm is in go. Okay. Boop. Sounds like everything's working. I hate doing this with stone farms, especially, because it's just so scary, you know, if you fail. But... That's the farm? Yep, that's the farm. Okay, well, I'm gonna be here for a bit. Gather up some uh, more stone bricks, and then I can finish up the mob farm. And then that's a stone farm and a mob farm done in one day, which is pretty good progress. And also, yes, this is AFKable, but I'm not doing it. I died in Operation Bedrock from AFK in it. I'm gonna get a regeneration. Oh, what? I was there for like a minute. <laughs> not even. But, anyways, that should be enough, I think. Not for the whole entire roof, I don't think, but that should be an, uh, enough to get a lot of this done. Um, but 
Yeah, I guess I can just go build this up. Oh, also, if you don't know how this works already, um, basically, the stone, stone bricks are the spawning spots. So this is where the mobs are going to be spawning, okay? And the uh, um, glass, they spawn inside the glass, okay? And then the glass pushes them off the edge. So they just immediately, immediately fall into the water system that we got then just die from fall damage because i'm not going to be making um this into an xp farm because i want this to be afk able because i'm going to be afk for gunpowder and yeah stuff like that basically um but yeah so i just have to do this um one more time after this well not the, just one more thing a whole entire another row and i just got the roof to do which is going to be taking up a lot of the stone bricks. Probably all of them. Probably have to get another refill, but it's fine because now we got a stone farm and it's going to be a lot easier. But yeah, that is how this farm works. So I'm going to get back to building. Well, um, this is the frame of it. Now I just need to fill all of this in but i got the measurements off by one block on this side so i gotta do this again i just need to do the frame for this side not the whole entire thing that would be insane but after i get this done i just need to either leaf the top or um light it up with torches i might just um light it up with torches and then light up the ground with torches too. Because that will give us max rates of this farm. Because a lot of mobs are going to be spawning under this too. Because um, first off they don't want to spawn in the glass. They'll spawn anywhere else. But if it's lit up then they have nowhere else to go to be honest. They have literally nowhere else to go. They, could, they would still spawn in it, but just not the rates wouldn't be as good. And mobs would be spawning everywhere else, so it would be really unlikely that they would come and just spawn in here. So I need to do um, a pretty decent amount of lighting up down there for this farm to work good. Um, but I think this is, this is gonna... Be done very soon here the annoying part though is just going to be the torching i am not looking forward to that that's going to be very annoying um but yeah i don't i don't really know anything else right now but all i know is that i'm not looking forward to torching up anything because Torching, I just don't like doing, honestly. I feel like I need to get everything exactly right, but I feel like it's going to be a bit easier this time because I can just, you know, it's, it won't, it won't take too long. I just have a lot of spots that mobs could spawn, and I feel like I just miss a bunch of parts where they could spawn, but that's really my only concern. And it'll help me out, too, because, honestly... I need to do a lighting up. I need to do a good lighting up. That's This is all I got. This is all the lighting I got. You see that? A crap ton of mobs are under this right now. A lot of them. There's like... I don't know. But when I was building this farm up... like when Before I even got to this part. Okay? The glass plate. That's gonna be an issue um <laughs> but um before i even got to the glass placing part okay there were millions of mobs down there it was insane there was so 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 much and that was even before i even got to this part it was before i even got all the water installed that's just how insane this farm is going to be okay I don't think you guys understand how amazing this is going to be. Eh. Okay, well, I'm going to go back to building. If I could get up. 
stupid thing. You know, I can just, you know, I can just go up like this. It's fine. It's really fine. I can just come up like this. Why not? I don't know why not. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get back to building. <laughs> I don't want to kill him. I want to. Does <laughs> water system work, huh? Huh, you punk? <gasps> oh, that I would have been angry because of that. If I would have fallen because I'm jumping while crouching and I let go of the stupid controller had me keep going, I would have been kind of mad, honestly. I would have been kind of mad. Time to head back to the stone farm. Yes. All right, now let's gotta line it up. Then just mine away. <gasps> the farm just broke. Farm broke for a second. That was weird. Hmm. That's strange. Very, very strange. Where the heck did my farming villager go? Did a mob spawn in here? No, I think a mob spawned in here. Did he just despawn? Really? Where did he go? I swear I didn't kill him. Don't think. Did I kill him? I might have. No, I didn't. Yeah, no, I didn't. That's strange. Very strange. Oh, I got the roof done. Yay. Yes. Okay. Um, okay, I'm gonna need one more bucket to scoop up that water down here. Jump. But yeah, perfect. Okay. Now in theory, mobs should be spawning in here, getting pushed down. But I'm going to be needing to light it up! I'm gonna need to be lighting up quite a bit down here, but look at how epic that looks. That looks amazing. I kill these stupid zombies and spiders. <laughs> Die! No, oh my god, it's so delayed. It's so delayed! What is this? I hate this controller so bad. It's so delayed. I hit like two seconds, four seconds before. Ugh, get in! I don't like you guys. Please stop it. You're hurting my feelings. Can I go in my house now without being harassed? And I'm gonna put an end to you and your stupid, stupid attacking. And I'm gonna make a farm out of you. You hear that? I'm gonna make a farm out of you. Oh, goodness. Stupid, stupid mobs. <laughs> I think that they're tougher than me. Goodness. I'm full netherite armor. They're just bowling me. Um, I might have overprepared on the glass, I'm not gonna lie. I got eight stacks of it. <laughs> but, I mean, I could do a mix of leaves and torches, because I got... I got two stacks of leaves left. So I could use some torches and leaves, so... That's what I think I'm gonna do, but... In the meantime, I mean, I guess I really have no more excuse but just to light up the ground first. And then I'll do the roof. Dang it, dude. I just covered up the whole entire water system that's leading up to it. How am I? Oh, yeah, I got um Elytra. I got the Elytra. Um, but, yeah. I'm going to sleep real quick and then I'll light up. Ah! There's so many! Jeez! Ah! How are there? 
there's so many! Holy crap! Chill, please. Is there any mob drops? No? Just stone bricks? Okay. Stop hitting me. Okay. Bye. Good night. Good night. You killed a skeleton with a bone, didn't you? You killed it with a bone. I'm gonna kill you with an axe. Oh, yeah. Um, I broke the sugarcane farm with water, by the way. If you... Yeah. Yeah. Broke the rails. Which is quite annoying. And I'm also looking for the minecart. I can't find it. I don't know if it got stuck again, but... I don't know what's go been going on with it. This has never happened before. In any of the other worlds, the minecarts never stop. Is there even a minecart here? Excuse me. There's not even a minecart. What the heck? Where are you shooting me from? Please stop it. Where is it? And then this stops. Are you kidding? What is going on? I mean, I guess I'm probably not going to be needing too much wool anymore. So I guess that's fine. I I'll let that one slide. But I guess I can just get back to lighting up now. This is good for the ground. Now I just got up on the rooftops, which I'm going to need some more torches. I'm not sure how much, though. But I could use my, the rest of my leaves as well. So I'm going to be used, doing that. But, I mean, I'm going to need a decent amount more torches. I just need the sticks, I think. So let's grab those real quick. Uh, let's just grab 11. That's, that actually worked out perfect. Um, <laughs> That should be enough to cover. And if not, we could um, always use the rest of our leaves or just our leaves. It might not need to be the rest. Um, let's get these out of our offhand first of all. It's, so n it's a nice feeling knowing that you got the best gear and you don't need to worry about upgrading it. Unless they add ruby or emerald armor, which honestly wouldn't surprise me. Minecraft turns into Terraria, you know? That, I, I feel that's gonna happen. Not gonna lie. But honestly, I'm not sure. We might be able to keep the leaves. But I'm just gonna start from the corner and then go from there. Well, looks like we need to keep the leaves after all. Um, this These are all the torches that we need. I think that's mob farm complete now now i just need to find an afk spot for us um i'm not you know i'm not entirely sure where that's gonna be i'm gonna build out a leaf so no mobs can spawn on me so maybe i need to be kind of close to the ground but not too close so that there there's no i okay i want them to spawn in these okay but i also want them to be able to fall down without despawning that was an issue in operation bedrock that i had so maybe i can do this very carefully i could get down you know i can just tower Or I can't, you know, that works too. But where are they coming from? Ah. You know, I didn't do the forest. Um, I'll probably need to do that, but that'll probably be either off camera or a different episode. Yeah, okay, I missed some spots over there. What was I thinking? I missed a whole chunk right there. But for the most part, I got a decent amount. Um, right here seems good. Right here seems like a good spot. Let's make this... Uh, three by three. Let's build a roof. Just in case of phantoms. And I think this is our AFK platform. 
So I'm going to AFK here for a bit. And then I'll be back. Is this close enough, though, is my question to the... I mean, looks like it. Are mob spawning is my other question. <gasps> it's working! This is already working very efficiently. And you know me, I like efficient things. Let's get back in the AFK spot. That's, that's lucky. Well, I'm going to AFK here for a bit, and I'll be back and see what I get. All right, I was here for about 5-10 minutes. Um, let's see. Three gunpowder there. All right, five gunpowder in that short of a time. Um, It's not too bad. That's not too bad. Um, Especially since I need to do a bit more lighting up. That's pretty good, actually, especially since I need to light up the area right there, which I might do right now. And I need to fix the... What's it? Whatchamacallit? Uh, sugar cane farm. I need a hopper minecart. And the... Um, some rails. So I might as well fix that as well so I can AFK that, because why not? Um, but that's, that's some pretty good progress today, honestly. That's very good progress, actually, but let's grab ourselves some rails, and then hop your minecart your, uh, <laughs> ten iron. That's perfect. Perfecto. 10 iron, and then, do I got, okay, nah, okay. And two logs. Just, and then we could just make a hopper minecart, and then replace up the rails. And that, that's good. And then I think I might call it an episode, because that, that was some pretty good progress we made. We got a stone farm up and running. Then we got a freaking, uh, what did we get? Um, oh yeah, we got a mob farm up and running. Uh, what else? Um, you know, I can't remember too well. And then we're about to fix the sugarcane farm. Which, as well, has been upgraded. But I think this has been a pretty good episode, to be honest. Not li- I'm not li- I'm not- I'm not gonna lie. It's been a pretty successful episode so far. We got some more rockets as well, which I'm happy about that. Um... Let's just go fix this up real quick. And then we're going to have a sugarcane farm, wolf farm, mob farm running all at the same time. <laughs> that's that's pretty OP. Not going to lie. Um, But let's grab our rails. All we need to do is just connect everything back up. And then that should be all. Look at all this sugar cane just sitting here. That's just from one row. Oh, that's... Wow. Oh. <gasps> that's a lot. And then we can just, boom. That's it. Boom. Now I'll unload that. Yeah, I gave it extra power just, just to make sure. Bounces back, grabs all of that. 
Ooh, okay. We're gonna need to add, add some bit of extra power around here. Ooh, don't break any of this. Oh. Ooh. We don't want any of that broken. <laughs> if you don't know what that, that, that holds up the blow. All the water for this. If I would open that, all the rails again. Bye bye. That would have been annoying. That would have been annoying. Just gonna say that. Maybe I can add the rest of these. Oh, it's emptying out all of that sugar cane. That's so much. How much is in here? What? <gasps> That's insane. That's how long I, I didn't have this running. That's insane of how long I didn't have that going. Holy crap. But anyways, that's going to give us so much more sugarcane, obviously. But not even that, I get to heal my pickaxe. Well, I'm going to craft a lot of this stuff up into sugarcane. But look at all of it. Look at all of it raining down. <laughs> and that's, that's a lot of sugarcane. <laughs> but let's craft up all of this into paper and then we can put the remaining sugar cane back <laughs> which there's quite a lot in here already but the more the merrier am i right or am i right Look at all of it! There's so much! Look at all of it raining down! <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh, let's heal up all my stuff real quick. And then I'm gonna call that an episode. Cause we got a lot done. We got a lot done. Obviously, it's going to heal my armor first because I'm wearing it. It heals what you're wearing first, not what you're holding. But that should have healed a lot of my stuff, but not my pants because those were pretty damaged. So, to be honest, I wasn't really expecting those to heal the first one. But they should heal the second time. And apparently, that's all that you want to sell me, huh, punk? But, yep, there. <laughs> well, now just time to heal the pickaxe. The good old pickaxe. <laughs> Boom. Boom. <laughs> and two more emeralds. Now time to run up. Um, buddy? <laughs> you got me worried there for a second. But all of the armor's healed up now, and our pickaxe got healed a decently amount. Good amount. But I think that's going to do it for me for today. Um, I hope you all enjoyed that little episode that I put together for you. Um, yeah, you know Christmas is coming up. Uh, if you could, you know, spread some joy to me, too. As I'm spreading joy, technically, too, because I make videos. Yay. Oh, what just happened to my head? What? <laughs> but anyways, please, can we get to five subs by Christmas? It would mean amazing. We're just two subscribers away from five subs. That, that would be awesome you know but anyways that's gonna do it for me today um see you guys in the next one bye